Hello everyone and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up couple on Emmerdale, split up after Ruby Milligan assaults Chas Dingle. It appears that tensions are about to flare up. Ruby Fox Milligan in Emmerdale, as she perceives red. Couple on Emmerdale, split up after Ruby Milligan assaults Chas Dingle. It appears that tensions are about to flare up. Ruby Fox Milligan in Emmerdale, as she perceives red. It's no secret that since moving to the village at the beginning of the year, Beth Cordingley's character Ruby Fox Milligan from Emmerdale has made a few enemies. Official ITV soap opera spoilers, however, indicate that she goes too far the following week. In later scenes, Ruby becomes enraged upon discovering that in spite of their preparations, Caleb Milligan, Will Ash, no longer desires to leave the hamlet. It appears that he had a brief change of heart after speaking with Chas Dingle, Lucy Pargeter. Later, when Caleb walks into the Woolpack, everyone greets him warmly. However, when Ruby follows him inside, things rapidly get ugly. A slanging match quickly breaks out as the Dingle family continues to sabotage her plans, making her brew for a brawl. Things take a dark turn when Ruby and the Dingles start to fight. Ruby unintentionally gives Chas a hard elbow in the chest, which escalates the argument. Ruby realizes her actions after having a double mastectomy as she writhes in agony. After Ruby hurts Chas, Caleb publicly rejects his wife and makes it apparent that he has chosen to side with his family. After what transpired, Ruby is devastated and unable to cope outside the tavern by herself. Though Dawn Taylor, Olivia Bromley, worries about Ruby as Caleb comes out blazing with wrath. Will Ruby be able to persuade Caleb that she accidentally elbowed Chas, or will he finally call it quits on their marriage? Ruby's wild behaviors appear to occasionally perplex soap opera star Beth Cordingly as well. That's definitely not how to make friends and influence people, she remarked in reference to her character's rants. She hasn't acquired that life skill. When you receive the scripts, it may be extremely annoying because all you can think is, oh my god, she's just rude to everybody. Beth defends Ruby's behavior by saying that attacking is the best defense for her. She seems to speak and act without thinking. She's very impulsive and spontaneous, Beth went on. Ruby just reacts very fiercely to things and then is often filled with regret afterward. Fans work out as Emmerdale leaves. A villager frames Eric Pollard after a secret is revealed. On Wednesday night, Emmerdale concluded on a suspenseful note as Jay Sharma ultimately revealed his father Amit's dishonest tactics. By assistant TV editor Abby Bray Express Premium Banner. Fans work out as Emmerdale leaves. A villager frames Eric Pollard after a secret is revealed. On Wednesday night, Emmerdale concluded on a suspenseful note as Jay Sharma ultimately revealed his father Emmett's dishonest tactics. Jai promises to make a mitt pay in Emmerdale. After Wednesday night's dramatic episode of ITV Emmerdale, viewers believe they have figured out how Amit Sharma's Anil Gautam narrative will conclude. At the conclusion of the show, Eric Pollard, Chris Chattel, who had been working to expose the con artist after he attempted to steal money from him, received a visit from Amit's son Jai Sharma, Chris Bisson. Jai originally dismissed Eric's accusations, but after witnessing him send proceeds from the hide to loan sharks, he came to understand who his father really was. But instead of telling Jai the truth, Amit pretended to be a mugger and said the money had been stolen from him. Jai saw the whole incident happen, little did he know. Jai added, You were right, Amit is a liar, a con man, and a thief, as Eric answered the door. I witnessed him today giving a loan shark the loot from the hide. There's plenty where that came from, Amit told her. Eric shot out, so he really is in serious trouble, but Jai shot back, clearly. I ought to have believed my gut. He lies obsessively, if he can do that, 
What else is in store for us? Jai went on to say, Emmett has been playing us all, looking for weakness. The businessman continued talking about his father's passing from the previous year, telling Eric he thought Emmett played a role in it. I felt and knew it, he angrily exclaimed. Emmett has been pursuing all of us, to defraud us. Since Emmett is bad, neither my family nor I should be around him. What are we going to do? Jai only answered, may him pay, to Eric's question. Fans shared their own views on social media after the episode, with some delighted that Amit will finally be revealed and others doubting Jay's reliability. One fan begged Eric on X, saying, Eric, please refrain from telling Jai anything you know about Amit. He is also not to be trusted. When it comes to the family in hashtag Emmerdale, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. I'm not sure I trust Jai, said another. He's never really appealed to me. He's been cunning all along. How can we be certain that, in an effort to keep Amit safe, he isn't attempting to dupe Eric into disclosing information that he may use against him? Hash to Jimmerdale. Another continued. Eric and Jai make a good team. I hope they bring down that nasty man Amit. Double departure on ITV Emmerdale, as viewers see a terrifying hint that Tom King would murder a villager. Bell Dingle from Emmerdale is in grave danger as the abuse of Tom King has taken an even more alarming turn on the ITV soap opera. After a few terrifying scenes, viewers of Emmerdale are gripped by the possibility that Tom King, James Chase, could hurt Bell Dingle, Eden Taylor Draper, Tom, who has been extremely cruel to Belle for a long time, and keeps telling her that she's the problem even though she isn't, has trapped her in a terrifying and terrible marriage. Tom demonstrated his want to always know where Belle is by stealing her phone and using his own to track her movements in an earlier This Week episode. After the show, he gave Belle a spooky call to ask how her day. When he checked his phone, he discovered that Belle was staying at a hotel in Leeds. After dating people like Lachlan White, Tom Atkinson, and Jamie Tate, Alex Lincoln, Belle hasn't had much luck finding love. Now, it appears like things are going worse as Tom plays a joke on her. Fans fear that because of Belle's previous relationships, she is experiencing the same terrible things once more. They believe they've spotted a clue that suggests Belle could be in serious danger, which makes them even more terrified. Tom is a psychopath, a viewer commented. With this asterisk 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 head, I believe Belle will be in serious danger. One person wrote, that creepy killer look on Tom's face WTH, while another said, Tom is still spying on Belle, hashtag Emmerdale, one person commented while another questioned if Tom was indeed tracking Belle hash to Jimmerdale. Tom looking angry because Belle is in the place, she said she'd be a fifth concerned fan said. I really really don't want this Tom and Belle story to go on another tweeted. Tom chastised Belle on their wedding day because she insisted on reading a special letter from her mother. Every time I've tried to get close to you today, to enjoy our day, all you've done is bang on about that, your family and yet you can never see it, he said, accusing her of spoiling their special day. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.